YouTube hangar video. All dimensions are in English. Sketch one. I created a three inch and a four inch diameter circle using the same center mark. Finished sketch and I extruded that inch and a half. And make sure you use this, not that one, but this one. Okay. Sketch two. I came out here, right clicked and went to slice graphics project geometry of these two circles came here first drew a five inch line then a two inch line and then I drew a line out and made sure it was tangent hit the tangent command choose the circle then the line then I went chose circle from center mark out and I trimmed off this part of the circle so we have an enclosed area here finish sketch and that extrusion was three quarters of an inch using symmetrical extrusion here Sketch three. I came here. Rectangle. First point here. Type in one. And then two for the height. Finish sketch. Extruded it. One and a quarter of an inch. Sketch four. Projected geometry, drew a one inch circle, and also, let's see if we can get that on there, a two, two inch diameter circle, same center mark, finished sketch, and extruded it one inch. Come back here and draw, let's see, a one inch diameter circle. We just need to clean up the inside there. Finish sketch and extrude that one inch. Okay, that's the part completed. Let's take a look at the IDW. Set up your views, front, top, right side view, and isometric in this fashion. Put all your center marks here using this command. And this one, set them up here and up here. Finish out the dimensions. Put a material, your name, and chapter, and exercise number.